Attention all 3D artists. Are you tired of spending hours on a project only to have distorted textures and misaligned materials ruin your hard work? Well, I've got a quick and game-changing tip for you. In just a few simple steps, you can properly unwrap and fix your object's UVs. This technique will help you save time and frustration and create professional looking materials. So if you're ready to take your Unreal Engine 5 projects to the next level, stick around and learn this quick and valuable skill. With just a few simple steps, you'll be able to create stunning visuals and impress your clients or audience. Let's get started. All right, so you've got a floor and a wall with the same UV problems. Just let me get out of the sequencer. And as you may have noticed, the materials and the magnitude of textures doesn't fit to the floor. So I'm going to select the floor and let's change the mode to modeling. So we have bunch of categories of modeling here and I'm going to select the project from the UV section and here I have bunch of details so now what I'm gonna do is to change the projection type to the box and after that we're going to set the dimensions in a way to get the best results and let's just decrease the materials and the UVs in the X direction and then in the Y direction and finally in the Z direction. I think 200 might be okay for the floor and you can see the results. The results are obvious in the Unreal Engine 5's editor panel and screen. Let me try 150. For example and yes I think now we got the proper dimensions and texturing for our floor and now it is time to fix the problem of this wall you can see it's a weird wall that we have and I'm going to go the same process and the same steps to fix the problem and you can see the change of the dimensions and the texturing and unwrapping on the wall. It reflects just like real time and the problem is solved just like that. But how we can know this, what is the best dimensions and the correct dimensions to fix? If you downloaded, if you have downloaded your materials from Quixel Bridge, uh, let me just go to some random materials and I want to show you something that would be so helpful to you. For example, let's select this brick material and you can see this icon here and it represents the dimensions of UVs of this brick material and it is 2x2 two two. and if you're going to assign this material to some random objects, you have to set the dimensions of the UVs to 2 meter by 2 meter. If you enjoyed this tutorial, smash that like button and subscribe for more Unreal Engine 5 tips and tricks. Join our community of passionate artists and developers and let's create stunning scenes together. Thanks for watching. See you in the next videos.